Thank you so much for uh, spending some time learning about what ZK Techo does. And uh, I just want to put some perspective. Everything we're about to go through, we are the original equipment manufacturer. And that's really important because we can provide consistent availability, consistent pricing, consistent interoperability, and consistent tech support. Right? One phone call, one vendor, one stop shopping. So on this display here, we're very excited to announce our Atlas Door Access System. Now, when we introduced Atlas two years ago, we wanted to make sure it was extremely easy for customers to utilize, to purchase, and install. So right here you have an Atlas panel. This panel eliminates the need for software. There's absolutely no software to license, software to download, um, uh, computers to requisition. This is by far the simplest, fastest access control system because we've eliminated the software. Right? We provide a mobile app. You use your phone or any computer uh, browser to access the panel, and the panel supports another 20 panels, so you can have up to 84 doors on an Atlas system, right? So how many customers do you have that are more than 84 doors, right? And now here at the show, we've announced, we've now gone to the cloud. So there's Atlas 360, and it's far more secure than any other competitor, because with Atlas 360, the data still resides on the panel inside your client's network. Only the management portal is up in the cloud. So now we've Management is far easier, and um, you have recurring revenue. We're very, very excited. So that's our small business solution. And then we also have our enterprise solution that we've referred to as the Pro Series, and our ZK Biosecurity is the platform where you not only have access control that scales up to 8,000 doors, Right? It also supports visitor management and video management, elevator control. It also supports our multi-biometric or multi-technology readers. You can see here on display, we have a variety of readers. The one really that's truly most impressive, here in a single device, you can recognize your palm, you recognize your face, or a QR code, or a Bluetooth, or both a low frequency RFID card and a high frequency RFID card. Every single possible credential you can imagine, all on a single um, device. And all these other devices are just var variations of it. So this is really cool. You gotta check out all our biometrics. Coming around the booth, we've now also introduced, um, we have an intercom system now. So the intercom system is totally wireless. And basically, if I'm a tenant and someone rings the doorbell, I answer my phone, hello, and I can see who actually is there because there's one directional video. And then it's two-way audio, so I can speak to the person. And if I decide I know who they are, I can ring them into my apartment building. I can also set up schedules. If I've got visitors coming that are maybe cleaning or utilities, I have all these set schedules I can set up so that anyone can come to my apartment at any time of the day that I choose. So convenient scheduling. This section here, we have the screens turned down, but this is our video surveillance, video management section. And you can either run this on its own as a standalone, or it's also integrated with our access control. So we can provide access control integrated with video management all on a single platform. So here we have a host of cameras. Most everyone in our audience are familiar, bullet size uh, domes and so on. Right, but all very attractive. And this is our visitor management. We have a patent on a process called Safe to Greet. Um, it was really conceived of during COVID-19 when you didn't want to touch surfaces and you couldn't be sure people visiting you had been exposed to COVID. So with our video management system, I would be sitting at my phone or a computer and I could invite you to come to my office. You would receive a QR code on your phone. And then when you come to my office, you'd come to one of the visitor check-in kiosks. You'd show your QR code to the reader, it would recognize the QR code, it would know who I am, it would spit out a QR code on a paper ticket, and then you could approach a turnstile that has a QR code reader, and you can allow yourself access into the building with your QR code. So completely touchless, and you don't need to have anyone enter, um, uh, escort you. So you can actually save money not having an escort uh, into the building. Now, that was pretty much all our electronic security products. But here you can see we have traditional walk-through metal detectors. This is one of our more popular models. It has 33 detection zones. It's really cool. It's not turned on right now, but if I walk through here with my watch, we have an LED that would only light up here, right? Or if I had metal in my shirt pocket, the metal would only light up here. Or if I had maybe uh, something in my sock or jewelry, maybe a knife, it would light up here. The idea is whoever's there standing with a wand would know exactly where 
where the metal is and they can remove it from me very quickly. Because metal detection is not just about safety, it's about throughput. You don't want to slow anybody down. Here is another shining star. This is Kronos. This is the world's first and only turnstile with an integrated metal detector. Now, the reason why that's significant, if you pass through a metal detector, it's just going to beep, and then you need a security guard to run after the person, excuse me, sir, could you please come back, wand them, right? Well, imagine this. The Kronos turnstile has barriers, and these barriers remain locked if that person is detected carrying metal, or perhaps if they don't have a valid credential, or we also have set up uh, anti-tailgating, where you can have a camera that's, ca that's counting people, and if there's somebody that's within close proximity of me, the barriers will stay closed. So now, this is not just a detection system, this is a prevention system. If you don't have the right credential, or if you have metal, or if you're tailgating, the barriers remain locked. It's the ultimate in security, right? Then, of course, we have another variety of uh, walkthrough. Um, we have the walkthrough metal detector, the turnstiles. We have a variety of gates. These gates are being more commonly found in cashierless stores. A lot of cashierless stores, you'll go shopping, and as soon as you get to the, uh, the entrance, you have to authenticate your account, and only then will the gate open up. This is becoming very, very popular in a retail applications. But you can also put it up in a lobby. Another introduction, there's been, uh, of course, there's a lot of concerns always with public shootings. Sadly, in, in schools, it happens far too often. As much as the schools want to have metal detection, they don't like the idea of looking like, like a prison if you have a traditional metal detector with a header. So here you have a pole that puts out a beam, a uh, three-foot radius of searching for metal. So now it's much more, um, um, much more inviting to come visit. And then lastly, we took them off display, but we are foremost a biometrics um, developer. There's biometric technology in all our access control systems, our time attendance systems, our point of sale systems. So we have on display at the show all the biometric camera modules that we put inside these devices that we also, uh, also sell to um, time clock makers who want to add biometric authentication. They can add our biometrics. If you're an intercom company, you can add our cameras and have biometric recognition. If you're a point of sales terminal and so on, so that's kind of like a wrap of what we do. I'd like to thank you all for your time. Again, I think ZK Techno is the closest thing you'll ever find to a one-stop vendor. Please do visit us at ISC West.